It's hard to be a part of a, of a five generation business because you have to kind of make your own imprint, but you also have to understand you're just a chain that, that's going to continue on. And so there's something really kind of rewarding in that what we're making is something that will affect people's lives on a very personal level. Stained glass has been in my blood for generations. We design and manufacture stained glass windows for churches, hotels, residences. When you think of stained glass and you think of it, a lot of times you associate it with uh, the cathedrals of Europe, for example. Um, these were originally drawn uh, to show figures in the Bible, to maybe tell stories about uh, the Bible to people who couldn't necessarily read or to bring in inspirational light. And so by designing images on glass, you can incorporate it into an architectural setting that allows light to come in and, and you know, create an environment that can't be done in any other art form or any other material. We just uh, recently completed a 3,400 square foot window for a church that was built in um, Leewood, Kansas, just south of Kansas City. And it's uh, nearly 100 feet by 40 feet, which is about the size of a basketball court. No window had ever really been made like this before. And so Tim and I, my, my uh, creative designer, we found a gentleman named uh, Narcissus Quagliata who um, Narcissus is kind of the most uh, knowledgeable about fused glass and so we've come up with a technique of painting on the glass using uh, fused glass to create a very contemporary um, uh, method that really has not been seen before and uh, I think will change the future of stained glass. By combining traditional techniques with fusing, with the capabilities of technology, those things I think are what we've really focused our energies on here at Jogan Studios to really push the envelope and create new possibilities in what people think of as stained glass. For me personally, what I want to kind of leave behind is that this perception that stained glass is built on a tradition that can also create something in a modern day audience. It just doesn't have to be necessarily limited to a, to a church or a religious institution. And so I hope that we can enter this artistic world, not only through fine art in the galleries, but also in public spaces where people feel like stained glass has kind of just improved their life, just at least for a few moments uh, in a day.